Uh, Garcia Marquez, I think, is one of the major writers of the 20th century in any language. I think he is extraordinary. Uh, when I did the first, the first book of his that I did was uh, cholera, love in the time of cholera, and uh, um, resonating behind or under Garcia Marquez's prose, as it resonates behind or under almost everybody I can think of who writes in Spanish, is Cervantes. Uh, Cervantes, Cervantes' style, concept of the sentence, concept of the way words are put together is there in Spanish. It is consciously or unconsciously, and, and you can speak to that better than I can. I think every writer in Spanish has Cervantes in his conscious or, or her conscious or unconscious mind. Now, we don't have a model like that in English. We have Shakespeare in poetry. We have the King James Bible in for poetic prose, but not in the novel. We don't have a prose model like Cervantes, at least to my knowledge. So uh, one of the things I asked myself before I started with Garcia Marquez was, what can I do to create the sense of another, of a model behind and under the prose in English, since we have nothing in English like Cervantes. And I decided that it was some, somewhere between Jane Austen and Charles Dickens was our Cervantes. In other words, the 19th century novel was our model for prose, for prose fiction. And so I, I didn't reread any 19th century novel, but that was um, the, the language that I had in mind as I was translating um, um, Garcia Marquez.